The Whole Foods diet is a unique approach to eating that emphasizes on the consumption of minimally processed foods. Picture this. Abundant plates filled with whole grains, vibrant fruits, colorful vegetables, lean meats, and a variety of nuts. All in their natural state, just as Mother Nature intended. This isn't your typical short-term fad diet that promises quick results but leaves you feeling unsatisfied and depleted in the long run. No, the Whole Foods diet is a lifestyle choice. A commitment to nourishing your body with all the essential nutrients it needs to thrive. It's about making mindful decisions to choose foods that are closer to their natural form. Foods that are packed with nutrients, antioxidants, and fiber. But why should we bother to ditch the convenience of processed foods? The answer lies in the multitude of benefits that a whole foods diet can bring. From prevention of chronic diseases to weight management, from improved gut health to a stronger immune system, the whole foods diet is a powerhouse of wellness. Yes, it might require a bit more effort in terms of meal planning and preparation, but remember, good things never come easy. And this is about investing in your health, the one asset that truly matters. So, if you're ready to take a step towards a healthier lifestyle, if you're ready to embrace foods in their wholesome, natural state, then the Whole Foods diet could be the perfect fit for you. Now, let us delve deeper into the benefits of this diet. Before we go any further, please like this video and subscribe to our channel. The Whole Foods diet is more than just a way to lose weight. This diet, which emphasizes the consumption of minimally processed foods in their natural state, offers a host of health benefits. Let's start with chronic disease prevention. A diet rich in whole foods is packed with essential nutrients and antioxidants. These substances help protect our bodies from harmful components like free radicals, which have been linked to chronic diseases such as heart disease, diabetes, and cancer. Several studies, including those published in the Journal of the American College of Nutrition and the Journal of Nutrition, have shown that a whole foods diet can reduce the risk of these diseases. Weight management is another benefit of the whole foods diet. Whole foods are typically lower in calories compared to processed foods, yet they're more filling. This is due to their high fiber content. Fiber slows the rate at which food is digested and absorbed, making you feel full for longer periods and reducing the likelihood of overeating. Let's talk about gut health. Your gut houses trillions of bacteria that play a crucial role in your overall health. Whole foods, especially fruits, vegetables, and whole grains, are rich in dietary fiber that acts as fuel for these beneficial bacteria. A thriving gut microbiome is associated with improved digestion, better immune function, and even a lower risk of mood disorders. Speaking of immune function, a whole foods diet can help strengthen your immune system. Nutrient-rich whole foods provide the vitamins, minerals, and antioxidants your immune system needs to function optimally. A strong immune system is your body's best defense against infections and diseases. It's clear that the Whole Foods diet offers numerous health benefits. However, it's important to remember that this diet is not a quick-fix solution, but rather a long-term lifestyle choice. It's about choosing nutritious foods that nourish your body and support your overall health. But how does the Whole Foods diet provide these benefits? Let's explore. The Whole Foods diet's benefits are supported by science. Let's delve into the scientific findings that substantiate the advantages of the Whole Foods diet. Our bodies are complex systems that rely on a myriad of nutrients to function optimally. The Whole Foods diet is an abundant source of these nutrients, as it emphasizes on consuming minimally processed foods in their natural state. Whole foods like grains, fruits, vegetables, lean meats, and nuts are packed with antioxidants. These antioxidants play a vital role in our health by neutralizing harmful free radicals in the body. Free radicals are unstable molecules that can damage our cells and contribute to aging and diseases like heart disease and cancer. By incorporating a diet rich in antioxidants, we can protect our bodies from this oxidative stress. Next, let's talk about fiber, a nutrient that's significantly present in whole foods. Fiber is a powerhouse that aids in digestion, helps control blood sugar levels, and may even prevent certain types of cancer. It's also a champion for weight management. You see, fiber-rich foods tend to be more filling, so you're likely to eat less and stay satisfied longer, which can help you maintain a healthy weight. Additionally, research has shown that a whole foods diet can improve gut health. A thriving gut microbiome is crucial for not only digestion, but also for a stronger immune system and mental health. The fiber in whole foods acts as fuel for our gut bacteria, helping these friendly microbes to flourish. Lastly, it's worth noting that a whole foods diet isn't a short-term fad diet. 
Instead, it's a long-term lifestyle choice that provides a guideline for choosing nutritious foods without strict rules to follow. It focuses on quality rather than quantity, emphasizing the importance of nutrient-dense foods over calorie counting. With all these benefits, it's clear why the Whole Foods diet is gaining popularity. While the benefits are many, the Whole Foods diet does require some effort. So, let's talk about the challenges that might come your way if you decide to take on the Whole Foods diet. One of the main hurdles that you may face is meal planning and preparation. Unlike processed foods that are often ready to eat, whole foods require a bit more time and energy to prepare. You might find yourself spending more time chopping vegetables, cooking grains, or preparing lean meats. It's not just about opening a packet and popping it in the microwave. This diet asks you to engage more with your food, to understand what you're eating and how it's made. On top of that, the Whole Foods diet requires a certain level of meal planning. You can't just grab something on the go. You'll need to think ahead about your meals, making sure you have the right ingredients on hand and enough time to prepare them. This can be a challenge, especially for those with busy schedules. But remember, good things take time, and this is about nourishing your body with the best fuel possible. Another challenge that might arise is for individuals with a history of disordered eating. The Whole Foods diet, like any diet, requires a level of control and discipline. For some, this could potentially trigger unhealthy behaviors or thought patterns related to food. It's important to approach this diet and any diet with a balanced mindset. Always remember, this isn't about restriction, but about choosing nutritious, wholesome foods that make you feel good from the inside out. It's also worth noting that switching to a Whole Foods diet might initially be more expensive than a diet consisting of processed foods. This is because whole foods, especially organic ones, tend to be priced higher. However, consider this as an investment in your health and well-being. Despite these challenges, the benefits of the whole foods diet can make it worth the effort. After all, what's a little extra time in the kitchen compared to a stronger immune system, improved gut health, and a potential lower risk of chronic diseases? Yes, it requires effort, but the rewards can be more than worth it. Starting the Whole Foods diet may seem daunting, but it doesn't have to be. This diet is all about embracing nature's bounty and letting go of processed foods. But how do you transition from a diet filled with processed goodies to one that champions fruits, vegetables, whole grains, lean meats, and nuts? Here's how. First, take it slow. You don't have to change everything overnight. Start by adding a few whole foods to your meals each day. Over time, you'll notice that your plate is looking more colorful and vibrant and less cluttered with processed items. Second, educate yourself about what constitutes a whole food. Whole foods are those that are unprocessed and unrefined, or processed and refined as little as possible before being consumed. They typically do not contain added sugars, preservatives, or artificial substances. The more you know, the easier it will be to make the right choices. Next, plan your meals. This might seem like a chore, but it's a fantastic way to ensure you're getting a variety of nutrients and avoiding the temptation of quick, processed options. Consider prepping meals in advance to save time during the busy work week. Another tip is to explore new recipes. There are thousands of delicious whole food recipes available online. Experimenting in the kitchen can make your diet transition fun and exciting. Remember, it's okay to have a treat every now and then, the Whole Foods diet isn't about restriction, it's about balance and making healthier choices most of the time. If you crave something sweet, reach for a piece of dark chocolate or a bowl of fresh berries. Finally, don't forget to drink plenty of water. Hydration is key to overall health and can help curb cravings for sugary drinks. Remember, the Whole Foods diet is a lifestyle choice, not a short-term fix. It's about nourishing your body with wholesome foods that it was designed to thrive on. With these tips, you can start your Whole Foods diet journey with confidence. While diet is important, let's not forget the role of exercise. Equally significant to the Whole Foods diet is the incorporation of regular physical activity into your daily routine. Exercise, like a well-balanced diet, is a key pillar of overall health and well-being. When we combine the Whole Foods diet with consistent exercise, we open the door to a myriad of health benefits. Exercise helps to burn off those extra calories that even the healthiest of diets can't entirely eliminate. It's also a fantastic way to boost your mood, clear your mind, and enhance your overall quality of life. But how do you start incorporating exercise into your routine? Well, the beauty of exercise is its flexibility. 
You don't need a fancy gym membership or expensive equipment. You can start with simple activities like walking, jogging, or cycling. If you prefer something more structured, consider joining a local yoga or aerobics class. Remember, the goal is to move more and sit less. However, it's important to note that not everyone's exercise routine will look the same, and that's perfectly okay. Your fitness level, interests, and schedule will determine the type of exercise that's right for you. The key is to find something you enjoy and can stick to in the long run. Consistency is crucial. Aim for at least 30 minutes of moderate intensity exercise most days of the week. This can be broken down into smaller segments if you're just starting out. For example, three 10-minute walks spread throughout the day can be just as effective as one 30-minute walk. Remember, every bit of movement counts. So don't be discouraged if you can't do a lot right away. Start where you are, use what you have, and do what you can. Over time, as your fitness level improves, you can gradually increase the duration, frequency, and intensity of your workouts. In conclusion, exercise is a significant component of the Whole Foods diet. It complements the benefits of a nutrient-rich diet by helping to maintain a healthy weight, reducing the risk of chronic diseases, and promoting overall well-being. With the right balance of diet and exercise, the Whole Foods diet can lead to a healthier lifestyle. As we conclude, it's clear that the Whole Foods diet offers a myriad of health benefits. This approach to eating focuses on consuming minimally processed foods in their natural state like whole grains, fruits, vegetables, lean meats, and nuts. It's a diet rich in nutrients, antioxidants, and fiber that can be beneficial for chronic disease prevention, weight management, improved gut health, and a stronger immune system. We've discussed the challenges that come with this diet, such as the need for more meal planning and preparation compared to consuming processed foods. However, it's important to remember that this is not a short-term fad diet, but a long-term lifestyle choice. It's about making conscious decisions to choose nutritious foods without strict rules to follow. As we've learned, the Whole Foods diet requires commitment and a willingness to make changes in our daily eating habits. But the rewards are immense. From a healthier body to a stronger immune system, the benefits are worth the effort. Starting the Whole Foods diet might seem intimidating at first, but with a bit of planning it can be a smooth transition. Remember, it's not about perfection, but progress. Small steps towards healthier choices can make a big impact. To complement the diet, exercise plays a crucial role in achieving optimal health. Regular physical activity combined with a Whole Foods diet can enhance the benefits and help you reach your fitness goals faster. So, let's embrace this journey towards a healthier lifestyle with the Whole Foods diet. It's not just about living longer, but also living better. It's about nourishing our bodies with the best that nature has to offer and reaping the rewards of a healthier, happier life. If you found this video useful, please leave a comment below. And before you go, thank you so much for watching our video and please make sure to subscribe to our channel. If you want to know the seven best foods to build muscle, watch the video on your screen next. Don't forget to check out our calorie and protein calculator in the description below to start your fitness journey. Here's to a healthier you.